We present a sketch-based modeling system to create mechanical objects made of planar linkages. Users only need to sketch a few poses of the moving parts of the object. And our system automatically generates a linkage mechanism that traverses all poses without collision. The linkage is ready to be fabricated and assembled. Given an input pose definition, our approach starts with sampling candidate linkage mechanisms. First, we add random perturbations to the input poses to allow the system to explore a wider solution space. We generate random pairs of rigid links to form candidate linkages. However, the generated linkage may suffer from various defects which we detect in the next step. When the mechanism does not traverse the poses in order, it is said to have order defect. A circuit defect occurs when the mechanism cannot be moved between two poses without disassembly. When two successive links align during the animation, the mechanism can follow two different trajectories, causing the branch defect. Also, when they are nearly collinear, the force transmitted by the first link to the second vanishes. In addition, collisions between the rigid bodies or between links are checked. Once a set of valid candidates are obtained, we perform a particle filter to improve the candidate linkages based on the cost function that is defined as a weighted sum of the soft constraint terms. Then the best linkage is selected to generate the output. The output of our approach is a 3D geometry that is ready for fabrication. The printed parts can be easily assembled. Here we show a sketching session to design a folding table. The user first draws a fixed body part, then three poses of the moving body is designed. The user also provides a desired location of the linkage at the initial pose. Our approach can quickly find the best linkage based on the soft constraints. The generated 3D geometry is ready for fabrication. The user can easily assemble the printed pieces without using bolts and screws. We show four more examples. The first one is a wheelchair example that has two moving bodies. The generated geometry is ready for fabrication. The printed parts can be easily assembled. The user designs a power shovel that has three moving bodies. Three poses are defined to control the orientation of the dipper during the motion. The user designs a bulldozer. For this example, the slider crank linkage is used. The user designs a sofa bed. And the generated 3D geometry can be fabricated and assembled. The user can interactively obtain different solutions by changing the weights of the soft terms. When only accuracy is taken into account, the moving bodies traverse the input poses very accurately, but the linkage might become unnecessarily large. More smooth trajectory can be achieved by sacrificing the accuracy and size, while a smaller size of linkage can be achieved by sacrificing the accuracy and smoothness. We conducted a user study to evaluate the benefits of our automatic approach over manual linkage design. 
we provided the participants with a user interface to attach links to the fixed and moving body of the object. The task was to find a linkage that allows the moving body to traverse target poses without collision. We asked eight participants to design linkages for a simple and for complex object. It took between two and eight minutes for the participants to design the linkage for the simple object. While the trajectories are free of collision, they are less accurate than the one produced by our automatic approach. Three participants found the second task too difficult to complete. The remaining five participants managed to design linkages for this complex object, but they are bigger than ours and yield significant errors in the trajectory. We evaluated the effect of the perturbation to the input poses. For the five input poses, there are only a few exact solutions that traverse all the input poses without error. By adding a Gaussian noise to the input poses, our approach can obtain more variation of candidates, which enables to find a better solution in terms of the soft constraints. Notice that the size of the linkage becomes smaller by increasing the Gaussian noise. Increasing the number of bodies adds more constraints, which reduces the valid solutions, but adding the Gaussian noise still improves the obtained linkage in terms of our soft constraints. Finally, we compare our approach with the previous work. We have implemented a subset of chakra, which is the most relevant to our approach. The approach does not consider any defect, collision, and the smoothness of the trajectory. As a result, the generated connectors may cause collision, non-smooth motion, and some defects. Also, chakra supports only two extreme poses, which may not be enough to achieve a complex motion. Our approach allows the user to add intermediate poses to achieve the desired motion on complex objects.